Hey guys, it's Nina with Spiritual Vibes. And Marianne with the Soul Sisters. We are doing a video today to do uh, to show you guys a gift that we're going to be giving to a really good friend of ours. And I just wanted to show it to you guys before we give it to him. That way um, you guys can kind of see like different things that we've been getting into lately and doing. Uh, so this is a spirit spine chime. Uh, this is, these are all, these are our sis. You go ahead and you explain the bones because that's your, that's your thing. <laughs> these are the spine from Dare that you see here. They actually connect. So if, if in between are the crystals, but if they weren't there, they actually interconnect with each other. Except there would be little, these, these little disc pads. Oh, hold on. Let me turn, I'm sorry. Let me turn the music down really quick. Hold on. Sorry, guys. Okay. I just want to turn that down really quick because, yeah, didn't so, want it to. Yeah, these are um, deer spine and they go together and the only thing missing from the spine is little disc pads that would sit in between their spine as well as our spine. Their spine are much larger, of course, than ours. And then the things coming off the sides, these, these are... This is part of, um, let's see, how can I explain it? Well, when you're... I mean, it's the spine, but it's like, it has yeah, to do with the rib, right? This is Kinda? their, this is the back of the spine here, as you see it. So this is, um, when you got the front of your ribs up here, and your ribs go like this, they curve and go around, and then they connect right here okay this is how your rib cage is protecting your body as a shield so then this is part of it going around connecting to the front so that's how that is i and love when she talks medical <laughs> shit <laughs> and so yeah some of them are gone because um animals got to these these were found you can see some teeth mark without the animals you know chewed them up right here so I know we've gotten a lot of questions, um, like where do you guys get these bones from? And so we go walking through the woods and, and searching for different oddities of what we can find, whether it's a unique branch or... And we also got really good friends that bring us special things all the time, so, so between us and them. Yeah, and, and this, you know, we'll find stuff like this. And then this is a skull, the skull of a deer. This is a, a really nice one because it's together, all the teeth are there, which is awesome. I mean, they got better teeth than we do. I know they do. So you guys can kind of see how this is all wire wrapped together. There's no chain. There's no, um, there's nothing else holding it together but wire. So I wire wrapped this whole, um, the whole spine and with crystals yeah, these are awesome crystals, and they're they're big pieces. So yeah, they can big. really emphasize because these are big pieces of bone. So you want to match the size of crystal. And we put a lot of bells on here because, like I said, it's a spirit bone chime. So you know when these bells are ringing, there's a spirit around. And this right here, this is a big uh, green aventurine spear, crystal ball. And then right here is another spine bone. So I did some wire wrapping, some more bells. This right here is a uh, raw fluorite. And it's a pretty big chunk too. Um, I don't know if it's looking as big as, you know what, let me get the ruler real quick so that they can kind of see. Take my yeah. Oh shit, dropping stuff. Okay. Here it says, you wanna? So that's just, you know, where the skull, and you can kind of see, and then right here inside, um, cause this part of the skull was kind of like, I don't know if it was already decayed or, or what, sis, what do you think happened right here? 
it wasn't chewed. It was like I think the the elements already well, had taken over. Yeah, this is usually there's something right, there is it's usually here, but the elements probably broke it apart. Yeah, because um, it's it's just corroded. You can see see the inside. Yeah, and that's mm -hmm. what I like about it. I like all those little I'm trying to focus. We have so beaten down. This is sitting here. We have you know you have no idea how long it starts to break apart and become brittle. Mm hmm. So it just little bit by little bit breaks apart and it just disappears. Otherwise, there would usually be something still here covering this. But that's what it looks like uh, in the inside when when that disappears. It looks like little like little ant tunnels almost. It's like a whole bunch of little caves in there. And um, right here, this is a black obsidian. Mm -hmm. And then, um, but the part that decayed of the skull is only like right up to here. So when I painted it, um, Marianne had the idea for me to outline all the um, parts of the skull to bring it out more. So like the eye socket around here, um, and then it's uh, the yin, the yin yang right here. Um, these are some other symbols that you guys might recognize as the twin flame symbols. Um, right here there's doves um, these would be like doves flying away and then over on this side are crows flying away and then there's a web right here and stars right here and then some more bells that I brought through what's this hole right here says what are these oh this is um Okay, so you got your eyes right here, your eye sockets, and then behind, this is behind your eye sockets. Is your eyes, you imagine when, when, you, when you're looking at a human or um, a deer, so their eye is just a little bit above here, right? But your eyeball is, is pretty big. So that's the room for the eye right there. Oh, okay, that's awesome. So, um... Yeah, if you guys have any, like, bone questions or anything, ask Red Witch because she's, like, she knows about this shit. She knows her stuff, I'm telling you. So, um, then I did bring some bells outside of those. The, um, little space socket thingy. <laughs> Almost like earrings because the ears would be over Yeah, kind of like <laughs> earrings, yeah. <laughs> and then right here, this is a raw piece of, um, celestite. And this is really pretty, too. Yeah got a lot of cluster yeah yeah it's nice and then right here um this is azurite and then some more bells emerald and clear quartz on top and you can see I did some more wrapping right here um and then up here is where you would hang it through that loop so this piece is really heavy, you guys. How how heavy would you say this is? Since know, it's almost as big as you. Arm, it's shaking. <laughs> yeah, let's see. I'm four seven, and this goes. Hold up on, to wait. It got kind of. Wait, it's got a. Okay, there. Okay, it goes up to my like, underneath my boob. <laughs> <laughs> Under her boob. Under her side boob. It goes to. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding, sis. I'm just kidding. I'm the one that got side boob. <laughs> so yeah. It's like, it's almost as tall as Marianne, <laughs> and it's, it weighs like, I don't know. Yeah, it's heavy. It's, it's pretty heavy. Keeping it that, my arm was shaking, although I really don't have strength in my arm because of my surgeries, but... And yeah. shake it, sis, so they can hear the bells. You guys right. can hear the bones, too. It's awesome. Yeah. So that's it, you guys. I just wanted to quick show you that, and... Um, yeah, just wanted to show you guys what we've been up to over here and some new things. Answer all your questions of like, where are we? Yeah, the bone questions. Bones. Yeah, yeah, because people are like, oh, what are you guys doing with these bones? Oh, I should show them the other ones really quick too, since we're on, on bones, on the bone topic. Hey, this, this should be a bag of bones video. <laughs> this is going to be a bag of bones video. We're going to show you guys what we do with our bones here. Here at Spiritual Vibes and Soul Sisters, we do bones. No, just kidding. <laughs> so this right here is a deer jaw. Then I did a dream catcher in the center of it. This is like a little bird skull. Right there, bird skull. 
and it has red jasper, Apache tears, uh, clear quartz. Uh, right down here, there's horse hair. These are turkey feathers. So this is like a, this um, this dream catcher I did with a lot of different taxidermies. The leather that we use for the cording is deer leather. Um, so it has different um, taxidermy animal parts in one piece. Yeah, the horse yeah. hair. Yeah. Turkey yeah, the turkey feathers. And then the other piece. Oh yeah, the other piece. Um, this is the other one right here. I'll try to zoom in since I'm so short. This one is another taxidermy dream catcher. Uh, the top part, that top right there, where you see that quartz crystal right there. That's a spine bone. Then these, uh, these right here, these are the deer jaws. And I painted these and this is a raccoon skull right there. And um, everything's hand painted. And then the raccoon skull has quartz. Sorry, I'm gonna get around really quick. You see it has quartz quartz crystals sticking out of the eye sockets. It's dream catchered in the center of the deer jaw. Yeah, and the center is the... Sis, what did you say? It reminded you of braces, right? Yeah. <laughs> like metal braces. Yeah, like there's braces on the teeth. Yeah. <laughs> so that's kind of cool too. Like if you're into that like um, oddity, you know, oddity kind of thing, it does kind of look like it's like braces. like. Matches our little baby bat. Oh yeah, you see the little bat up there? Oh, this is a bat, you guys. I don't know if you guys could really tell, but this is a bat uh, dream catcher made out of bones. And then he's right next to our little baby bat over there. He was a preemie that didn't make it first flight. <laughs> All right, you guys. I think that's it yeah. as far as... Oh, show them the... Show them the... Um, or do you want to show them the, the little the bone ding-dongs? Oh, yeah. So we, yeah, we have a section that um, is for the 18 and over because, you know, that's that kind of section you need to do work on, um, whether it be for good or the, for the bad, depending on the situation. So this is our section here. All the youngsters need to ask their parents or us. And this is the section. We'll probably just show the bones. That way they... Yeah, because just in case, in case kids want to see this, yeah. So we put this, we put these particular bones in here. Just, I mean, just tell me you don't know what that looks like. Uh huh. So we have all these kind of little bones in here for this purpose. And what do you think? What do you think that bone is from? Like a knuckle, kind of, or? No, um, it's probably from. Um, I'm thinking it's from the uh, the the paws, you know, oh, okay. the, the feet. Yeah. Because they have little. Um, if you look here, it's, it's a joint. It's where something would connect. But see how they're so short. So they're, it's so large. It's probably from their feet. Okay. So like this would be something up here. Okay. Like a. Like the, yeah. the top part of, part of their paw, and then there'd be another bone that would connect for the for the. The short, the little, smaller pieces. Okay. That would be in here because it's too little to be anything major. Yeah. They're probably their paws because they're all the same. Yeah, they're all the same. We got like a bunch of those they're too. All the same. Yeah, so those would be good for doing your, um, you know, your love magic, your, um, you know, any magic that it is that you want to deal with that masculine and energy. All yeah, it was it all sizes, size all widths. <laughs> got, you know, baby deers, yeah. There was adult deers, so. Yeah. Oh, and then over here too are our, you know what, you guys? We had a shit ton of bones, and we like went through them and picked out all the ones that we're gonna use. But these ones are all up for sale in here, and you know people have been finding some good stuff in here too. So, uh, yeah, we do have bones for sale. Um, so if you guys are needing any bones or anything, um, you guys could also let us know. We have all different, you know, all different kinds of bones. 
um, ear and a spine too. So if you guys want are wanting to do anything with bones or anything like that, just so you guys know, we also sell bones. Um, and I think that's it as far as bone talk, right? Yep. Right? I'm trying to look. Yeah, for right now. All right, you guys. Well, thank you for watching another one of our videos. This has been um, bag a bag pleasures. of bone pleasure. <laughs> All right, you guys. Well, we'll see you at the next one. Blessed be. Blessed be.